I'm gonna show you my stocking that Obi that Obi got for me. Um, we have a single-use camera, which I'm like maybe the most excited about this. Um, and then he got me these like fancy matches that I like, but I was nervous to ever buy again for myself. Um, some nail polish, um, a new candle. Um, to peel off masks, Peppa, and a like really pretty bullet journal. And it says rise and shine, and it says it helps build schools. A portion of your purchase goes to build schools. It was it's cute and sad at the same time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here, you want to help me? Makes my heart cry, Dad. I know what you mean, Daddy. Okay, that's a little too deep. <laughs> it's, a weird, it's like deep in a weird way. What, the fact that he ate one of them? No, he's saying my heart like crying. Oh, oh I, I thought totally that was like it. really poetic and clever. Yeah. Oh my. You say, for, I told Ford what having your heart, heart hardened meant. Mm-hmm. Smiles and wishes, and I want it all from the lights oh. to the so tall. Tell me one thing is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. Whatever we do. Holiday wonders will open your mind. May all your wishes tonight come true. The love I live, the dream I knew. This Christmas, I only want to be close to you. So this was our big present this year. It's the real live action Mario Kart. Um, this is what it looks like in the house. And I'll show you what it looks like on the screen. Our puzzle's famous. It's only it's like half an hour to lunch. Um, I'm going to do basically use everything that I got in my stocking today, or as much of it as I can. Starting with um, the nail polishes, um, I think I'm gonna do this guy. 
Um, but I kind of want to do this one too. I really like this one. Um, okay, and for those of you, because everybody always asks about nail polish, oh, these came in my stocking. Um, and they're from Urban Outfitters. And this one's called Oat Milk Latte. This one is called Fool's Gold. And this one is called Cherry Glaze. I don't know how to choose which one I'm going to use right now. Um, and then we're going to go into face mask. And we're going to use some Hibby matches. And have a grand old time. Socks with sandals. Really? The nails are done. I don't know if you can, they're obviously messy around the edges. Um, two things, when I used this, I kind of did like the press down method and just kind of like put it, I didn't really like paint it on um, to get the glitter like more dense. Um, and then I, fun hack, I put lotion around the edges of my nails. Um, and then when I paint my nails, I inevitably always get, uh, nail polish around the edges, but then when I take my shower, it comes right off. So I'm gonna take a shower in just a minute and that should come right off. But fun, new, fancy, shiny nails. Um, now I'm going to order us some groceries for the week. We're out of like a decent amount of stuff. Um, so I'm gonna order those and then my nails should be dry by the end of it. Groceries are ordered, and now we, um, last year, Ford and I made um, these like bags of just like things that people who are experiencing homelessness like need on the streets, like gloves, hand warmers if we could find them, um, hand sanitizer, stuff like that. So now we're going to, I'm gonna re up because we just gave the last one away. Um, and so we are. Yeah, I'm gonna order the stuff for us to make new ones um, via Target right now. Um, okay, <clears throat> so I thought I would tell you what we got to put in our kits. Um, I'm gonna add one more thing to our order um, real quick. And then I will tell you what we're doing. Um, so I, from Target, ordered uh, we're due to do like five kits at a time. So once we hand out the five, we'll get five more. And we kind of just keep them in the car and when we see someone, which is Asheville, it's kind of often um, we hand them out. Um, last year we did like a big old marathon building it out, but um, that's just like a little bit more expensive at one time so we can kind of pace out our, our money. So we did hand sanitizers, um, wet wipes. We did like facial wipes that you could use like on your body if you wanted to. Um, socks, granola bars, water bottles, 
um, travel first aid kits. Um, I did Kleenex. Um, Target has these like dental health kits. So it's like toothpaste, mouthwash, toothbrush, um, chapstick, um, a pack of tuna and crackers. And then um, on Amazon, I ordered two pack, like a pack of like gloves, like so have, like 12 pairs of gloves and then 12 hats. It was just more affordable to do that way. Um, and then tomorrow I will go to um, both Starbucks and McDonald's and get $5 gift cards um, to put in there as well because when you, when you give someone like a $5 gift card to a place like that, then they have not only, um, you know, it's like COVID, you know, 2020, so it's a little bit more complicated, but typically like, um, they could like buy a coffee and hang out for a while. So they have like a warm place to be in the winter. Um, but also it's just kind of like a dignity thing. Like you get to choose, um, like what you want. You don't have to like show up. You have like, they have like their money they're coming to, um, buy with and they get to pick what they want. Uh, so I think that that's something that I would want if I were in that situation. So, um, yeah, that is what we're including. We'll have most of it tomorrow, or most, most of it today, but we'll probably build them out tomorrow. And then um, we will get the Amazon, the gloves and the hats from Amazon. Um, we'll add those in later. I also forgot to say um, face masks. We ordered a pack of 50 um, face masks on Amazon. And so we can put like multiple masks in there for them. Um, Cause I just like cannot imagine um, what it would be like, what it's like right now for them. So um, that is what we're doing. I'm gonna go take a shower and then do all the skincare in the world. Um, also, I loved that coffee, but I need more. So I'm going to make a shot of espresso um, real quick pre-shower. Um, I'm going to have, let's see, um, actually, we are waiting. Um, Starbucks just came out with um, all of our packages. Um, Starbucks just came out with the um, blonde roast or like Voltesso, which is what our Virtuo? Virtuo. <laughs> I'm just, the Virtuo um, pods. And so we ordered some blonde ones and they're supposed to come today in the mail. So maybe I'll check and see if we got any packages and maybe it's here. Um, also, this is fun. Um, one time we had snack for Ford's classroom and I sevened out and got really excited about the idea of these little juice barrels. And Obi was like, honestly, like that's kind of like a weird thing to feed to children. And so <laughs> we didn't take them and we have like a 25 pack or something that's been there for like maybe two years. And I guess Ford opened one. Um, so I went out and got the, well, Obi went out and got the mail for us. Um, and I didn't have the Nespresso pods yet, but I did get two other packages and I don't know what they are. And I thought we could find out together. I think this is my, I think I know what this one is. Um, this is my new planner. Um, you've seen this before. Well, you will see this soon um, in the video. But um, I got a new planner for the beginning of the year. I'm about to finish my current one. Um, so I'll start a new one in January. Um, that is from the Life Map Collective. Um, she's from Michelle B. She's on YouTube. Um, and then this is the other package um and i don't know what it is and i wonder if i hope i'm not opening a christmas present but i don't think i am oh um they're joy joya joyja um i got new period underwear i wanted a second pair so i have thinks i have one pair of thinks um, and then I bought a new pair for, to have one on like that day where you're like not sure if you're going to start or not. 
Um, and they're like really pretty. So that's what that is. Fun. Good mail day. Um, I also found, I have the like UPS tracker where you can like see where your truck is. Um, and I was able to like locate the truck and decide if I could wait for espresso until it got here or not. And I cannot because where they are right now is like 20 minutes away if they were driving straight here. So um, answer that answered that for me. I'm going to make an espresso, take a shower, and then and then we'll, we're really gonna do skincare today and we're really gonna take a shower, I promise. I don't wanna change out of my pajamas. <laughs> Um, so I'm just out of the shower. I, um, the groceries are here. Obi and Ford are putting those away. I'm about to order dinner. It's our, you know, it's, we had two Christmases. So we're going to do grown up Christmas on Christmas and today's kid Christmas. So we're going to do kid things like order pizza, watch a movie. Um, and so that's going down, but, and then the person is shopping for our, um, the kits that we're gonna build tomorrow for people experiencing homelessness and those will get delivered in a little while. But I'm gonna order pizza and then um, I'm not gonna be able to do like my full facial like I was planning to, so I'll probably do that tomorrow. Um, I'll probably just use like the Summer Fridays jet lag mask and call it a night. Um, but I did, when I was in the shower, I was thinking about how this season is so hectic and how it's like really overwhelming for my system. And then I was like, you know what? This is actually kind of a blessing in disguise because um, I'm about to, at the end of this season, you know, go do my CEO retreat where I plan and vision and cr I'm creating a whole new curriculum for Brave Collective that is completely centered around people who are struggling to find this balance between self-care and busyness and how like even right now like I'm in my bus busiest season of the year and I'm still journaling every day still doing yoga every day I'm still getting like plenty of water um, you know like my version of being stressed out is is not neglectful of self-care anymore and but I'm able to remember the pain because I'm not nor this isn't my normal right like this pain point is not my normal and so um, it's like really distressing and I'm just like reminded of the distress of the people who are joining the collective of like what they've been through, what they're going through. And it really like has like bumped my empathy muscle up. So that as I go into thinking about like, yeah, how do I make sure that this isn't my normal life? Like what are the things that I do and how can I support them more? And my heart's just like so much more even tender to that issue than it was before, which it is always, but man, it's fresh right now, you know? So, um, I'm kind of grateful for it in that way, if that makes sense. Um, for me, there's an end in sight and I chose this. And so there's just so many people who that's not the case for. So I just wanted to share that. Ouch. Watching 
got myself a little Christmas treat. Okay, we're gonna watch this movie. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. We're just gonna watch the movie and then in the night, in the night there. But happy early Christmas to all of you, and I will see you tomorrow for day 13 of Vlogmas. Bye.